questions you need to ask yourself when choosing a trail running shoe. For example, what's the terrain like? How long are you planning to run? How often are you going out? And ultimately, how does the shoe feel on your foot? Let's get into it. So the first question you need to ask yourself is where do you run? If you are going to go for a run in your local park or maybe just literally off the road, then you're going to want a multi-usage shoe, which is a fabulous compromise between protection, weight and grip. When it comes to the lugs, don't overdo it. You're going to want a compromise between two and about four millimeters. So just so that it's nice and steady on the trail. For trail running where the ground is far from hard, where you've got, for example, you might have snow or mud, you're going to want to have a lot of concentration when it comes to the lugs. So the deeper, the better. For off-road running, rocky running, or even going off trail, look for shoes where there's lots of protection and stability. Here, we want to make sure that the uppers are nice and reinforced and that you have rigid outsoles. Look for medium-sized lugs on the bottom so that you've got grip, but nothing too crazy. Now let's talk distance. This makes a big impact in the shoes that you are going to buy. If you're just doing a quite short distance, maybe around 10 kilometers, you're gonna want a shoe that is comfortable, light and nimble. However, as soon as you start getting towards medium distances, you want something with a bit more cushioning, a little bit more support, you're going a bit longer. Anything around 50K to ultra trail, that's when you're gonna want maximum stability, maximum protection. Your feet are gonna suffer unless you really look after them over those long distances. Now we have covered all of the basics and looked at where you can run, it's now all about you. You need to think about your objective when you're trail running. Finally, with all the information that we have shared with you, you can now go and try and find yourself the perfect running shoe. Try on a few models to see what works best. After all, it's quite a subjective thing, so see what really works for you. A couple of technical points though, just to bear in mind. Keep a one centimetre at the front of your toe, as we spoke before, in order to give a little bit of room so that when you're running, you can allow your foot to move about a bit more and have a nice secure fit around the midsole. Trying shoes on at the end of the day can also give a really accurate fit for when you actually go running. Enjoy yourself, love running, and go and get yourself a pair of trail shoes.